Hi everyone, I'm glad you're here. Thank you very much for joining me. It is Wednesday, hump day, April 9th, 2025. Yet again, there was another earthquake, a magnitude 1.9 near Marston, Missouri at 10.06 p.m. local time. Did you feel this earthquake? Yeah, there's been a lot of earthquakes within the, just the last month, at least 11 near Marston, Missouri. And you can see I got many of them marked here on the uh, the map on the Mississippi River up there close to uh, New Madrid, the city. Marston, Missouri is located in the New Madrid seismic zone in the heart of this area. One of the most seismically active regions in the United States east of the Rocky Mountains. This area poses a significant earthquake threat due to its history of powerful seismic events and ongoing activity ongoing activity the new madrid seismic zone is known for the uh, large 1811 1812 earthquake the largest earthquakes in u.s history it was estimated to have a magnitude between a 7 and an 8.0 this is the location of last night's earthquake. The earthquakes that occurred between 1811 and 1812 caused widespread damage, altered the landscape, and were felt over vast distances due to the region's geology as far as Canada. The earthquake waves went through hard bedrock and the zone is known to generate hundreds of small earthquakes annually. Too small, too minor to be felt or detected by seismographs. So now, now they're saying that some of the earthquakes are too small to be detected by the equipment they have set up. Yeah, a lot of people are saying, yeah, we feel all these vibrations. There's a lot of them within, within the last month. Let me show you. 11 right here just on this map alone all the way down to this little yellow dot here you can tell here most of them were on the west side of the mississippi we got one two three at least three that were a magnitude 1.9 and one was 6.2 miles in depth the other one was shallow only 4.6 miles in depth the other one 1.2 um, excuse me 4.4 .4 miles in depth very shallow all these earthquakes means that Marston is persistent and it has a persistent risk both small and frequent tremors and the potential for a rare major event Marston and the surrounding area particularly this area given the previous of older earthquakes unreinforced building and the potential for soil liquefaction in the Mississippi River floodplain where Marston sits. Damage projections for a 7.6 earthquake suggest severe impacts in Missouri's boot heel. They call this the boot heel. Um, so the threat is very serious with the potential of building collapses, utility disruptions, and economic losses in the billions of dollars across the region and then you got the threat of fires that could also break out such widespread damage would mean you would be cut off from emergency services it would probably be maybe several hours or even days before anyone could get to you so you need to plan to be prepared um, on your own while the threat is real predicting the exact timing of a large earthquake remains impossible. The frequent small earthquakes near Marston serve as a reminder of the active fault system beneath it, but they don't necessarily signal an immediate large event, so it gives you time to prepare. With all the recent earthquakes around the world, it's just a matter of time. So yeah, you got time to prepare, hopefully. You just don't know. It could happen tomorrow. It could happen 50 years from now. So what are your thoughts? Have you prepared for a large event near Marston? Please put your information down below. Thank you very much for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe. And I'll talk to you later. God bless you. Bye.